following the crowd. I agree with that, man. Some people should not be on high risk, bro. If you ain't, if you've been playing this game and you ain't been able to shoot the last five 2Ks, why do you think that you can come out here and put it on high risk? Why would you do that? Hey guys, it's LJ. Make sure you like the video and subscribe for more great contents for my daddy. Good morning, I did 2K land, man. Check this out, man. So we got a good show for you guys today, man. Really, the main thing we're going to talk about, we got Famous Enough talking about, you know, he's asking some pertinent questions. We got Quavo, Quavo telling the truth. We got your boys, you know, people talking about shooting and all that good stuff, man. Last but not least, we got Tassino telling y'all how to fix some stuff and Joe knows bearing it all, man. We're going to talk about all that in one second. But before we get started, make sure y'all like the video and comment y'all thoughts down below because y'all know we're trying to go with this thing. To the moon, Alice! And if nobody told y'all this today, y'all my brothers, my sisters, my family, love each and every last one of y'all. Yes, Gambit is shooting with the shot stick, man. Uh, this is one of those things that we came out here and we were doing some shot stick testing. We just wanted to see how how good it was and uh, how viable it is. And uh, like I said, man, one thing with the shot stick, like uh, somebody did say, there is a delay when you use it or, or what have you. It feels like a delay. Yeah, Brute, I should have dove on that one. I should have dove in the first place. That's my bad, I see it now. But hey, look, good shot for a better shot. And this something that my man Groundhog, he did a video too, and he's telling y'all, hey, once you learn how to use the shot stick, you can shoot through contest. So you don't have to worry about if somebody's closing out on you or anything like that, you just have to smoothly shoot the shot and you will be good to go. But that's what we testing out in this game, man. But, but first, that boy Famous Enough says, why y'all want to create content now that it's over? And he's talking about with the 2K League being over, you know, a lot of people were pros. Why would you want to, why Why do you want to create content now? And I guess well, it's, it's blatantly obvious because you don't have a choice, but you could have created content the entire time, built a platform that would have helped, helped, uh, push your brand as well as the NBA 2K brand and perhaps the league would still be going on right now But however, we chose to just hey, we don't want to do that. The only thing we want to do is You know play the game do this. I'm a pro. I'm a pro. I'm better than you talk to people on Twitter And then like instead of pushing the agenda like bear to BC bear He's been doing content the whole time So this is natural for him and I'm sure he probably still on the contract with the league or whatever I'm not absolutely sure don't quote me on that But what I do want to say is that that's the way that Bear, Splashy, and other people conducted themselves during this time, that's how you want to conduct yourself. You're in the 2K League, you're a professional, you're winning tournaments, you're doing a lot of stuff, but also you are pushing your brand because you want, you know, you want to get your uh, get yourself out there, get your name out there, and so when it's over, you have something to fall back on. I think that it's over, fat, and words and code, all them guys, that's what they were doing. So. I just think that they didn't think it was gonna be over this quickly, which is unfortunate, but that's just where he is. Cruel reality situation that nothing lasts forever. Entropy is the natural order of the universe. Uh, we all go toward zero. Like everything goes towards zero. Or you know, at first, first you wanna go towards stasis, and then after that, everything's gonna to go towards zero. That's just the natural order of things. So everything is going to end. Even the sun will burn out of the sky. And they say that the universe, but we don't know what's going to happen with that. But they say the universe is going to collapse and re-explode. And I'll see y'all again in 14 billion more years, man. But hey, hey that's, that's way over a lot of people here. We ain't going to talk about all that, man. What we will talk about is my man say what's wrong with that. He says what was wrong with doing it before it was over. And that's right. I feel like this <laughs> is uh, because they're goofy. Why the dude do that, man? But listen, listen. I agree 100% with my guy, famous enough right here what was doing we're all doing it before it was over because you can really push the agenda and push things push your own narrative and get the, and get things done but now that you don't have a choice this is where we at this is what we're doing can't even get mad at it man everybody can make their own decision we learn you know you make it better the second time around and that's where we at with it man up next we got all city saying this is the fastest i've deleted 2k ish sad man so disappointed and so, uh, and so the Flash says, hey, man, I'm really surprised, bro. Uh, it's different from 2K24, but there's there's a, a lot going on under the hood. I hope you give it another chance uh, once the once lunch day bugs are slayed. Uh, I always appreciate hearing your take throughout the years. And then he says, hey, I guess I had a high expectation, a higher expectation uh, than they, they were they were able, then they were able to de deliver on this year i'll definitely continue to gather news and info throughout the year i ain't a lot of y'all man like i said man y'all talking about me crashing out bro I, I me myself i was having some issues i was upset with the game i was about to crash out and i told y'all i said listen if i feel like this right now i can assure you 
that tons of other people either feel like this or they will feel like this before long and hey that's where we are with it man it, it, like i said and he, he ain't the first one he ain't gonna be the last it just is what it is man um hopefully he does come back though because all city one of the good guys man i appreciate hearing his take on things and all of that and that's one of my guys man so hopefully he's able to you know when once they get everything straightened out he'll come back to the game and you know but we don't know what his frustrations with the game are but i'm sure we're going to find out because he does always do a very good job of saying hey this is my issue this is that and uh this is what i you know this is what's going on and uh yeah i, I see what you're saying right there brute when i was doing all that man i was trying to throw the ball i'm gonna tell you the truth i was trying to find me a lane so i could throw the ball off the backboard man that's what i was trying to do i tried to throw myself a self alley but it wasn't working man up next hey we got solo saying what's your three-point percentage don't lie I don't know what my three-point percentage is, man, in this game. Let's find out. We're going to find out live. Get it. We'll do it live. Uh, What is my three-point percentage in this game? As I as I splash one to uh to take us to take us out of here, man. Like, look, I don't know if I shot this with the stick or not, but this is my first shot. And, hey, man, trays up. Splash down. We're going to find out what my three-point percentage is live, though, man. So let's find out. Uh, I don't even know how to really check it. But we're gonna go city and uh it don't I don't think it has the VIP stats. Uh the the the, 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 the I, bro, I don't know 2k card. I don't know how you check any of that stuff. Cause I don't really care. Uh there we go. 48%. So 48%. 48%? That's 50. 48% after shooting abysmally um you know and 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 I, I i definitely get that up so i had some days where i couldn't even hit i couldn't throw it in like i said i was standing on the rock of gibraltar i could not throw the uh throw it in the ocean uh in the, in the into the mediterranean sea i could not do it but now i'm good and i'm bite man so look let's see what some people said man my man said hey 33 percent uh 100 this dude say 42 percent 42 percent 43 percent i know see it like that shooting about 48 percent this dude lying with 80 uh 36 41 48 40 43 40 so i it looks like i'm in the higher percentile man a lot of people right there 56 percent in wreck probably only played a couple of games in wreck or whatever though i don't know what i am like i'm probably i'm i don't know if i'm shooting any better in wreck that's the city in wreck yeah 34 percent in wreck but uh i don't even know i didn't even start turning up in wreck and i don't think i played well how many games i played in wreck 11 games so there and then uh pro-am 35 percent man so hey it is what it is but the city is the easiest place to shoot in and a lot of that was before i had this monkey dunk before i had this jump shot that i have now and like i said with just a, with, with such a small sample set uh you're going to be able to you're gonna be able to get that up easily, man. So once y'all get a good jump shot, you'll be fine. And then, like he said, 44% out there. I think that they really want the averages to go toward like 40 some odd percent, man. Uh, but like I said, when I was playing them games, I had no jump shot. I didn't, I didn't know what was going on. And I was just like, you know, you know how it is. You jump in and the guys is like, hey man, let's just run. And you start running and that's that's just what it is, man. So, hey, but 48% ain't bad, man. We're gonna see. That boy Quavo Quavo said, hey man, y'all have y'all have one good game and post it. Like my dude, we knew that you went 20, I mean two for 24 the next game. And he's not lying about that, man, because a lot of times you get out there and you exactly what it is. You think you have it all figured out and then the next game you cannot hit a shot. I'm gonna tell y'all one thing and one thing only. Time and stability is very important. I have a new jump shot. And this jump shot that I have right here, I wanna, I don't know what the time and stability is on it. If y'all gonna get this jump shot, I'm gonna drop it in the video later, but my jump shot has a b time stability so that's what you're gonna want at least a b time stability or something like that y'all might have some shots where y'all are hitting and you don't have b time stability but for me i only got an 83 ball that's that's another thing a lot of people and don't say don't say <laughs> i got an 83 ball but i mean I'm, I'm hitting this and i only got a 79. shut the fuck up shut the fuck up bro y'all boys got that 83 ball and then y'all also got like y'all might got the 83 ball or the 79 three ball but you got like an 89 midi i got a 70 midi 70 midi and an 83 ball just so i can get the 99 now in my next bill i'll have an 85 three ball and a 75 midi so i'm really gonna be hooping uh shooting 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 but on this one because i wanted to go with the 99 still to test that out for y'all and i gotta get that video out for y'all asap don't do 99 still it's trash 
uh, compared to whatever else, because I swear that all of my my badges stopped working when they got on Hall of Fame. And then when I when they turn red, they're even more useless. Like I might get a pluck here or there. I might get a pluck, but it really ain't worth it, man. I'm gonna tell y'all that right now, because anybody can steal the balls. You might as well go with 91 steal max, man. Up next, hey, 2K25, the movement. They say, hey, fix shooting, man. Hey, he says, hey, but those. But those that are slow, fix shooting doesn't mean make shooting easier. It makes it, it means makes it more consistent. Say these boys, these boys want to be comp like other dudes who putting out clips, <laughs> who putting out clips when they have one get gay talking, taking high, talking high risk. Humble yourself, put it on low or medium, and enjoy yourself. Stop following the crowd. I agree with that, man. Some people should not be on high risk, bro. If you ain't, if you've been playing this game and you ain't been able to shoot the last five two Ks. Why do you think that you can come out here and put it on high risk? Why would you do that? Come out here and hit some of these whites like these dudes hitting or something like that, bro. But like, like, I don't get it. Like if you was a shooter shooter in other 2Ks, I get it. But if you ain't been able to shoot the last five two, the last good shooting 2K you had was 2K15, not the patch four when anybody can shoot. You can shoot that thing with your toes. Look, I get it. But 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 don't don't do that if that was if that's what you had. And as soon as I say you can't get no plucks, I get one with the red joint, man. I don't know, man. It is what it is. But but yeah, if you ain't been able to shoot since 2K15 patch four, when after which everybody can shoot, man. Don't don't put yourself on high risk, man. It's just not. I don't. I think it's just not worth it. Uh, do do yourself a favor and put it on the joint where you can hit it. Hey, man, I'm gonna keep it a stack with your. Uh, I'm gonna keep it a stack, yo. Uh, shot change your shot change way more than last year. That's what Splashy said. Um, and like I said, I think that that's that's with the that's something that comes with time and stability. But there are definitely I have not identified all the catches and whatever, but I do see two. It's more like 2K23 where you got two different shot time. It's like you it might be 15,000 of them, but it breaks down. They fall into two different categories. And I can tell when I'm gonna get the fast one and the slow one. And actually you can tell when you're gonna get the fast one and the slow one by how he catches the ball, where he catches the ball and stuff like that. I'll break that down for y'all in uh, in another video. But he also came back and said, hey, what shot timing are y'all on? Uh, what, yeah, what, what shot timing are y'all on in the controller settings? And like I said, man, I don't know. I'm using, um, I use my custom timing or whatever, but I also use the, the I don't use the real player percentage, I use the other joint. So I use high risk, high reward, and then I used on my own custom timing, I'm not on that. But that doesn't have anything to do with it because Mike said, when you when you use that one, it really doesn't matter, man. Up next, uh, when, when you use your custom, your custom overrides what it says there. So, it, it, you know, that's just how that goes. Up next, hey man, according to 2K Lab, this is, this Schmack says, according to 2K Lab, Schmack! He says, according to 2K Labs, there is no pure green window on NBA 2K25. Even on high risk, high reward shooting, full bars are actually back in the game. And we all know this to be true, man, because we're sitting out there. We know that we're timing the shot perfectly. I'm timing it the exact same way. Just like in a video I did last night, I'm timing this, I'm using the shot stick and I'm like, I'm timing it the same way. I'm matching his hand. And here and there, they just, I think it's really based on your distance from the rim and stuff like that too. But here and there, I would just inevitably get a shot where it would just say tempo was too fast or it was slow or, you know, something like that. It just, it just would not work, man. So it's, it's one of those things where, where you have to, you, you gotta just take it, take it, get it how you live, man. Like, I guess is what we saying, man. Cause that boy Don work, he really just said Mike Wong spo spoiled us, spoiled people with the shooting patch back in NBA 2K24. Now MFs think that they are entitled to greens. Now MFs think that, that if they suck, some, something is wrong with the game. If, I mean, it's never a skill issue because they were good. They were so good in NBA 2K24. This, this is what happens when you constantly cater to bums. Dang, he called y'all bum. Dang. Calling them boys bum. Dang. Dang, dang, dang. Dang, he take them boys up out of there, boy. Hey, it is what it is. When you constantly cater to, uh, we said we cater to bums. 2K24 was a game that that you could shoot with your eyes closed. I promise folks weren't as skilled, weren't, weren't as skilled as they might have think thought. And that's what we said after 2K23, man. We was like, hey man, maybe it's a skill issue. And uh, maybe that's what it is. But a lot of people were like, nope, not a skill issue. Uh, it is what it is. We need the game to be fixed, man. Up next, that boy Badgy Plug it, say, man, this thing gonna send me to therapy. This is something that happens to me a lot too, man. Like somebody throws a Stevie, you hit it. 
the offense gets bro but he tipped it in bro that means that all he was just doing was just spamming the square or spamming the x on this man i don't know man something like this happened to me i'm turning the game off man i'm not even gonna lie to y'all man that might be that might be what what i'm gonna do what y'all gonna do if that happens to y'all y'all let me know last but not least man i mean oh down to the nitty-gritty that boy tacino says <clears throat> FYI, rhythm shooting makes the shooting in, in NBA 2K25 way easier. Huge green windows, Beluba was right. Uh, right stick down, then up in motion with the short. Well, up, up in motion with the short. Probably won't use square again against, uh, again, uh, again for most of my shorts. And then somebody says, hey man, yeah, you gotta, you gotta stroke it the right way. Pause, man! What's wrong with y'all, man? Pause! And then Ticino says, fuck. So hey, it is what it is, man. Tacino giving y'all the giving y'all the soup. Then that boy shoot anyone, shoot everybody. Say, hey man, you telling me I gotta dribble the, I gotta dribble, then speed boost, then flick it to uh quick stop, then flick down, flick the stick down, then up the shit to shoot. <laughs> Ah, he says harder harder to play point guard in 2k than in real life he said i gotta play i gotta play like steez though and then obviously tacino he just started laughing man but you're right man like but that's what tacino been doing man he's been hooping and getting this thing done last but not least we got that boy joe knows says i ain't i think i don't know if we covered this yesterday he said ain't no way a big guard is isoing a top lock in pro-am right now back to the drawing board at least he being honest with it man he's not putting out a lot of false content and saying he out there hooping and doing this and that man he just said i gotta go back to the drawing board if you watch the joe knows streams every night they won the games but it was just difficult he had shock at the two uh bh2 but it was he, they won the games but it was hard for him to get done what he wanted to do you can't you just can't get it done with the big guard right now right now he's gonna figure it out though because he always does and he said this is why i wait to make my second bill and joe says hey he says i always give you all my honest opinion that's why i test everything i can to try to help and he says and you are appreciated don't think it doesn't what hold on now he, he he really meant to say don't think it goes unnoticed because it doesn't man but hey and it is what it is somebody up here man they say need more two guard twos guards man hey man dudes out there shooting 40 percent. maybe i'm comp right now uh because i'm shooting more than 40 i'm shooting 48 percent of everybody else in them low 40s and i thought i was doing abysmally but hey it is what it is man let me know what y'all think down in the comment section i want to know how y'all are doing how y'all are shooting put your shot um your shot joint down there in the comment section let me know what y'all think down in the comment section are you shooting well do two, does 2k need to make a change is it a skill issue any of that stuff let me know what y'all think i'll be out there i'll holler at y'all next time till next time it's your boy jay easy aka fresh from the barbershop bk the people's champ see y'all on the court Gosh, baby.